What's up YouTube, this is URC Shadow and welcome to a strategy guide for the second setup mission of the Prison Break heist and this is called Bus. So unlike all the other missions in this heist, there aren't any special roles or teams in this one. Everyone's a ground crew and you're all going after the same objective which is to steal a prison bus as it leaves the Bolingbroke Penitentiary. So you're going to be starting in Los Santos in your apartment, your crew is going to make its way to the prison and as you approach this point on the highway, the prison bus and its police escort, including a helicopter, will start to leave. So this is the route in red that the prison bus is going to take. And these areas are marked in blue are the areas we can take the bus once we've hijacked it to lose the cops. Therefore, I've highlighted two points along the route, point A and point B, that are ideal places to intercept the bus and hijack it. And we'll look at both points in the video. So once you have hijacked the bus and everyone in your crew has lost the cops, you'll then need to take the bus to the drop-off point, which is nearby. So looking at interception point A first, you'll need to take out the bus driver, and you can do that with a range of weapons, sniper rifles one, and the marksman rifle, to be honest, is probably the best. As soon as you've killed that driver, you have a 3 star wanted rating, and any of your crew getting involved will also have a 3 star wanted rating. Someone from your crew needs to get the bus, and then everyone else can either jump on board or follow in their cars. Now there is a police helicopter, so someone is going to have to take it out. It is a little bit of cheating, but the best way and quickest way is to use the homing launcher. With the helicopter out of the way, you shouldn't get any more spawning. So all you need to do now is head towards one of those two light blue areas that we marked on the map earlier, both of which are sort of hill mountain ranges, and then wait there until you've lost the cops. There are a couple of routes up the mountains, some are more easy than others, and if you're one of the ones following in a car, just be mindful that the bus isn't that powerful and may get stuck halfway up and need a bit of a hand. Once you've lost the police, as a crew you can all go to the drop-off point and deliver the prison bus. So coming back to interception point B on the highway that we saw earlier, this is where the prison bus has already made it on and you're going to have to do a drive-by on the driver to take him out. If you're attacking from behind, don't forget the driver is going to be on the left-hand side, but then the door to the bus is going to be on the right-hand side. Again, once you've taken over the bus, drive down the highway until you find a gap in the central reservation and then take a left and start heading up that hill again. Once all your crews arrived and they've all lost the cops, you can then start your journey back down the mountain towards the drop-off point. And there we have it, it's relatively straightforward. Don't forget that if you're playing on hard, the crew members will get $5,000 extra as the payout, but also you don't have any spare team lives, so if anyone dies, you'll fail the mission and you'll have to start again. So anyway guys, I hope you found that useful. If you did, please feel free to like and subscribe to support the channel. You can check me out on Twitter, the address is at the top, and you can click the annotations on screen now, or the links in the description, to see strategy guides for all the other missions in this heist, as well as all my other tips and tricks videos, how-to guides, and mission strategy guides. Cheers guys, thanks for watching.